The Upper Peninsula Diabetes Outreach Network has many resources for people who are at risk for diabetes. Local 3's Melissa Venix tells us about one woman's success with a diabetes prevention class. With the help of Ann Constance and the Upper Peninsula Diabetes Outreach Network, Lynn St. Aubin says she lost 30 pounds with the class and likely delayed or prevented the onset of diabetes. Seeing all of the different risk factors made me realize that I was at higher risk for diabetes than I even thought I was. Um, the only thing I thought was a problem was my mother had been a diabetic, my grandmother had been a diabetic, and so I knew that family history could be definitely a risk factor. St. Aubin took a pre-diabetes risk assessment test after getting a flyer about a diabetes prevention class being held at the Nagani Senior Center in 2017. Ann Constance, director of UpDon, says the class teaches about food, exercise, and stress management. Each week we cover a different topic and each week each participant gets a handout you know, so that they have something to take home with them that they can refer to when it, when it works for them. And we weigh in every week. There's a weigh in. We're not doing that since we're doing Zoom, but I'm still asking people, you know, to check in to see how their weight's going. And we talk about that. We start every class with, so what didn't go well this week or this month? And, and then we turn to the positive. So what went well? St. Aubin says it's the support system from other class members that has helped her stay on track. And gave us the tools that we needed. She gave us the guidance that we needed, but man, the support that comes from those other people that are in the class is, is just fantastic. Uh, this time of the year, we only meet with Anne once a month during the winter months, and um, we get along so well, and we need each other's support so much that we've actually been Zooming every week. Upton is currently only offering classes to current course members right now, but Constance says the same course is offered through Michigan State University's Extension. It meets once or twice a month for an entire year. Reporting from the studio, I'm Melissa Venix, Local 3 News.